everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I thought I would come on and do a Morrison's food haul for you all. So I just want to just say that there isn't any kind of like fresh or frozen stuff here. It's all mainly just like snacks, that sort of thing. And a few like random like bits and pieces. Only anyway, I'll show you what is here. I just want to make you aware also that if you are watching this months and months ago, since it was filmed or a long time ago that always check the app for the sim values because they do tend to change quite often with Slimming World and to protect your weight loss check the app but I will tell you now the things that I will mention here and the healthy extra B that one I've got to show you will um, they are as accurate I checked it today on the app so of the 22nd of the 6th 2019 so it is accurate of today, but any other day it might not be. So please, 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 will you check the app beforehand? So we shall start with um, some oats. So simple. These are the big bowl ones that you can do in the microwave with the sachets. So this is uh, your healthy extra B one of sachet, or it is seven things per porridge sachet. So I bought two of those. I then also picked up some of the Yorkshire Tea Biscuit Brew. This is sim free on the plan and it tastes really good. If you haven't had it, give it a go. If you can get it, it is so difficult to get hold of. So much so that I bought four boxes of it. But yeah, pick it up if you can. It is really, really good. It tastes kind of like kind of malted milk biscuits or like nice biscuits, but very good anyway. So I did like, I have been enjoying it. I finished the whole packet and I picked up four now. So I've also picked up some of the Yorkshire tea. This is the bedtime brew and it's got like vanilla and nutmeg in it and it's got decaf tea in. So I find it helps to make me sleep a little bit better at night. I don't know if it's just me thinking that, but I always seem to want to fall asleep halfway through drinking it, which is probably a good sign. So yeah, um, it's sim free as well so you can have it as much as you want i have it with a bit of milk at night so i also got some of this vtech rice this is the long grain microwave one so you get two pouches and i'm gonna say it's half a thing per per pouch because i had a look on the app and i can't find this particular one but i can find the 300 gram which is the whole tray and it's one thing, so this is 280, so each container is 140 grams, so I would count that as half a thing each. So yeah, I picked that up, it's quite good, I like it because it's kind of nice and stodgy, I like stodgy rice. <laughs> so it's great just to stick in the microwave, um, and it's not too bad if you don't want to do like cook rice from scratch and take it to work or wherever you're going to use it, or at home. You can just have this for half a thing and it's portion controlled so you don't have too much of it so i quite like that i bought five of those to keep me going so that will last me a little while next i got some of this fiber 190 this is the triple chocolate cake bar this is my favorite i prefer this over the carrot cake one and this is uh, four scenes per bar which i think is worth it i don't think I know that the other bars that you can get, I don't think they're worth it at all, like the little square ones. Um, I think they're just not worth at all, so I like to get these ones. They've got nice little chocolate balls on top, which I don't think are necessary, but it's like it's got gooey bits inside. I like. <laughs> if you didn't know already, um, I love chocolate. So next I got some of this Cadbury Dairy Milk. These are the Caramel Freddos. They're four and a half scenes per Freddo. You get six in a pack and they are 19.5 grams per bar. So four and a half scenes for one of those. I also picked up a Nestle Aero. These are just like the bubbly single bar chocolates. Um, they're seven and a half scenes per bar and this is a 27 gram bar in here. So you get four in a pack. I should have bought, picked up the mint ones because they are sev they're seven scenes, not seven and a half. So it's kind of, never mind. I'll eat these anyway, but I would have preferred like a lower scene, but never mind. I then picked up some Cadbury's 
12s, there's 11 in the pack here, and they are a 21.5 gram bar. And they are, let me check my book, they are six things per finger, so they are quite good. I picked up a pack of crunches, this is the nine pack in the multi pack, and they are 26.1 gram crunches. Now, these are six things, and you need to be careful with the crunches, they do a lot of different multi packs in different places, do different, it seems every supermarket does something different. Um, but you want to pick up the one that's 21.6, 26.1 gram bar because it's six things. Uh, the last lot I picked up, I think, was seven and a half things. So that it varies widely in different places. So keep an eye out for that. I then picked up some timeout wafers, Cadbury's timeout wafers. I don't know how many they, I think this is the only style that they do. They're usually in the biscuit part. But these are 21.2 grams per bar and they are five and a half scenes. Let me just check. Yeah, five and a half scenes per bar. So I do like them. So pretty good. I then got some skips. These are three and a half scenes per pack. There is six bags in this multi-pack and let me see, they're 13.1 gram per bag. So they're not much in there, but it's good enough. They're quite light. I like my uh, crisps to be low seamed or as low seamed as possible. Um, hula hoop puffs, everyone knows about these. Um, these are just the salted flavour, six in a pack. They're 15 grams in each and they're three and a half seams per bag. My favourite is salt and vinegar, but I'm having a problem trying to get them. I don't know why. I don't think they've been discontinued. I think I'm just not looking hard enough. Um, next, French fries. Are these the Walker's French fries? They are 18 grams per pack. I bought a 12 pack, multi pack, and they are four and a half seams per bag. So, yeah, I don't know if it varies if you buy a smaller multi pack. I don't think it does. I think it varies if you buy them on their own, just one pack on their own. I then picked up some Cadbury's Milk Chocolate Sticky Puds. These, I am shocked at how many things they are, but I think I should have known that they would be quite high. So one of these pots here, they are 19 and a half things. So yeah, I'll still eat it. I'm gonna, I'm having it with a friend, so it will be fine. So I'll just, be extra careful with my sins that day if I'm going to have one of those. Um, of course, I'm not going to have that on its own, am I? Because I have to have custard with it. So, I also picked up some Ambrosia Devon custard. So, I bought the multi pack, they're 125 grams per pot, and they are six sins for each pot. So, it's going to end up being quite a high pudding, let alone what dinner is <laughs> never mind it'll be what it'll be but um i'm still going to eat it uh i will just put it out there that they do do a light custard and i don't think it's worth it because it's only five and a half cent so for a half a cent extra you can just have normal custard i don't know what the differences are i'd have to have a look but I haven't actually checked, but for half a sin, I just don't think it's worth it. I might as well just have the normal custard. So next I got Vimto Squash Remix. You all know this is my favourite, always has been. So I've been having it because I don't drink enough water and I thought it would be a good idea. I was drinking water and now I'm not. <laughs> so I've been having this and I find that I am drinking a little bit more. So this is the raspberry, orange and passion fruit flavour. No added sugar, sim free. And I've also tried the other flavour, strawberry and watermelon and something else. I can't remember. Strawberry and watermelon and something else. I wasn't overly keen on it, but I can drink anything. But I wasn't, I didn't love it, put it that way. <laughs> but I would drink it if that's all that I had. I also picked up some Pepsi Cherry Max, just uh, one pack. This has got, I think, eight cans in here. So this is also free too. Uh, what else? Oh, shampoo. 
Herbal Essences Shampoo. This is the White Tea and Mint Detox Daily type stuff. I've always used it for as long as I can think. And I also picked up Herbal Essences Conditioner. This is beautiful, and this is the only one that seems to unknot my knotty hair. <laughs> but it's very good, so I've always used that. And Sanox Pro Hydrate. This is for very dry skin. Shower cream. It's okay. I think it's probably better than some that I've tried. I also picked up some Nivea Body Moisturiser. This is the in shower one, so I use that instead of like other lotions. And it does quite a good job, to be perfectly honest. I used to use um, the very dry skin one, but they don't sell it at Morrison's anymore, so I wanted to get the discount. So I just buy the one they do sell at Morrison's and that happens to be the normal one with like the aloe vera in. So the only thing I will say, when you put it on it, it kind of feels a bit cold, but it's nice, I like it. It does seem to work quite well anyway. My skin isn't as dry as it was, so that's quite good. I then also picked up some of these skincare facial wipes. These are the ones from Morrison's. I've never used them before. I normally use Simple Micellar water wipes but because I'm wearing a lot more makeup I'm going through the wipes quite quickly and I think that because this is a pound I feel like I'm not wasting I feel like I'm wasting with the other ones because they're very expensive and I'm going through them quite fast so I thought I would see how this goes these are for like normal and combination skin they did do another one for dry skin but not one for sensitive so that's what I would have picked if they had it was for the sensitive skin but I didn't see any um I shall let you know what I think of them they're Morrison's own I'll let you know I'll probably um when I've used the packet it'll probably go in my tops and flops video that I keep meaning to put up but I've got other ones that I will do but when I do it will go in that so yeah that is absolutely everything I think let me just check those everything Yep, that is everything that I have to show you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did. Feel free to comment down below if you've tried any of this or can recommend anything for, to me that you think I would like. And I shall see you in my next video. Thank you all for watching. Bye everyone.